regenerative medicine. It's a term we're going to be hearing a lot about from this point on and refers to harnessing the body's innate ability to repair and replace damaged tissue. In Western Australia, biotech company Orthocell is creating a huge buzz in this field as it works to create a bit of biotech to regenerate damaged or severed nerves. Can you imagine bringing movement back to a paralysed limb? They're currently 10 years into their quest. That's 10 years of research and trialling. Have they finally unlocked the holy grail for surgeons? Trudging through the bush, it was just quite peaceful and serene. Two minutes later, on the grounds, after hitting a tree with my head. Perth father of three, Adrian Walsh, broke his neck that day and life as he knew it changed forever. You're staring at the roof. All I kept on thinking was about me and the kids. Alex is a Perth-based orthopaedic surgeon, the surgeon that other specialists send their trickiest cases to. He's continually seeking out the latest advances in the world of medicine to improve outcomes for patients. We've been trying to put nerves back together since the start of the 20th century. We've traditionally done it with stitches, and they're big, difficult, and then we got a bit better with microscopes, we can still put together. But the intrinsic problem with stitching nerves together is the stitch itself causes damage. Rempler is one of a suite of products developed by Orthocell and it's been a decade-long odyssey. It's the result of the work of Orthocell co-founders Professor Ming Hao Zheng and Paul Anderson. So now what we try to do is try to introduce this scaffold material that it mimic the outer layer of this nerve structure and thus it creates a very nice local environment. It actually can guide the nerve fiber, just like electric wire, uh, into the muscles. Our key invention is actually we are able to develop a collagen materials that you mimic the body's own collagen with all this natural fiber. The novel combination of biotech and surgery has now been successfully used in more than 20 patients in Perth, and it's a long way from traditional methods. What we did was use our experience in, 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 in medical uh, science to help us to understand what type of collagen would be right, what shape of collagen would be right, and how to apply that collagen in the right way. And so we used our clinical acumen, our, our clinical knowledge, to pull together a product that was fit for purpose and that had a scientific narrative that enabled the surgeon to justify its use. This is a device that uh, I've discovered that allows us to join nerves together with minimal or no sutures. Uh, so what it is, it's a bit of collagen membrane made out of a skin and it's in two layers. It has a nice shiny layer on one side and the, all the fibres in one direction and there's a rough layer on the other side all the fibres are in a different direction. Now these, the smooth side, is a nice barrier to stop things from sticking to the nerve. And on these, or the rough side, it's like a scaffold or a ladder so the nerve cells can grow down these collagen fibres from the one side of the injury to the other side and it helps them line themselves up and join the nerves together. And it's quick and it's easy and it's reliable. And we can teach our registrars to do this in just a couple of days. So Paul Anderson came up to me when we were in the cadaver lab and showed me this and was wondering if I could help use it to uh, join tendons together. And I took one look at it and I always thought that this would be better in joining nerves. And the rest, they say, is history. And so making the operation shorter, making the operation easier, and making the, the outcomes of those operations more consistent and predictable is really the holy grail in this space. In the past 12 months, 90 Australian surgeons have learned how to use this bit of biotech. And it won't be long before American surgeons and surgeons from around the globe are following suit. It's a really unique bit of Aussie biotech.